information. Thanks, Stefan. Hundreds of people right now are looking for good jobs, and they got a chance to find a new opportunity today. This is in Walker County. Yeah, very important day. WIET 42 reporter Tim Reed is up in Jasper, where many are hoping this is their chance to get back into the workforce. Thousand people attended this job fair in Jasper. Now I spoke with some unemployed mine workers who are now hoping to get new jobs. It's been a devastating experience because it's like it's like you have to start all over again. Chad Rackard worked as a miner for four years in Jefferson County. He was laid off three months ago. That's why he came to Jasper looking for new opportunities. We would love to see the coal mining industry, you know, come back, but at the same time, we've got to look at, you know other other careers now we can't just you know close our sights on one thing anymore 54 different employers from companies around the area were on hand accepting resumes four hours at the West Alabama job fair many who signed up to look for jobs are unemployed steel workers and miners massive layoffs people that have been in jobs for a long period of time uh, again through no fault of their own or not working so there are resources that are available that through our state agency we want to be able to connect those jobs with the people that are looking for work it, it'll list every every job available in the police department many who are out of work like Chad Rackard are keeping their fingers crossed hoping for the best. Of course you see there's competition out there and you just you just pray for the right doors to open. Officials will be holding another job fair in February in Brookwood. In Walker County, Tim Reed, WIAT 42 News, coverage you can count on. What a great avenue there to have an opportunity for those doors to open like you said. You know